Hey YouTube, Randolph here. Today I have nice stuff for you. It's about Elder Scroll Online again. It's my second video. This time it's about uh, the map, Cyrodiil. So how big is this map? And for this, uh, a lot of friends asking me this because they didn't have the chance to play the beta. And it, you look at the videos, you see it's big, but how much big? I will try to quantify this through these videos. And the best way I can quantify this is uh, comparing the ba Eternal Battleground from Guild Wars 2 and Cyrodiil from Elder Scroll Online. And I just want to be clear, guys, I don't want to start a war between Elder Scrolls on Online and Guild Wars 2. It's not uh, the goal here. I just want to use the make the comparison between those both games because they're very similar on the World vs. World. And I find interesting uh, to compare those both maps to, to give the people a certain point of reference. So here we have Cyrodiil. It's the Elder Scrolls Online map for World vs. World or uh, Alliance vs. Alliance. As you can see here, I put a two dot, and as you can see, I will run from this tower to this tower only for this video purpose to show you how the small fraction of the map I will cover in this video. And on the other side, you have the Eternal Battleground from Guild Wars 2. It's a well-known map. It's one of the biggest map they have on the World vs. World. And as you can see on the red, I just tra trace the path I will follow to uh, from up to down. So this is the old map I will cross uh, in Guild Wars 2, so check this out guys. So here we have the result guys, it takes 2 minutes and 55 seconds for Elder Scroll from tower to, to the, this tower and for Guild Wars 2 the timer is 3 minutes and 20 seconds for uh, 
up and down all the map in the, from the eternal battleground so if you take a look at this you can understand that the map of Elder Scrolls Online the Cyberdale is very much bigger than the eternal battleground but uh, on the other side Guild Wars have different instances of Borderlands so maybe if you put them together you can approach the Cyberdale but I'm pretty sure that Cyberdale is much bigger than all maps together uh, maybe with the new map Edge of the Mist you have all the content but it's in you have the instance but in Elder Scrolls here you don't have instance it's one big map and you have this so it's a pretty huge map and I think now you can figure out how big this map is and finally here uh, I make some drawing and you can see here's five paths each path represent almost three minutes of running with the horse so it's pretty much 15 minutes to run from the point you see up there in the top left corner to the down right corner I approximately uh, see like 15 minutes for this and as you can see this weekend I will make the run and I will test the run how much time it will take and I will make a new video after so stay tuned for this guys take note that uh, I was on the horse of 15% speed in Elder Scrolls videos and in the Guild Wars 2 with my warrior I have a 25% um, movement speed faster with the, the trait I had so you can take in this in charge so this is it guys I hope you enjoyed this and now you have a better idea how big is Cyrodiil don't forget don't forget to subscribe like and share and keep on in guys and I have an extra here just check this out Oh yeah guys, that was my first duel in Elder Scroll Online and successfully I win. So I hope it's not my last one and I'm pretty sure it's not. So stay tuned for more PvP and stuff guys and keep on in guys.